Okay, today we're going to show you the uh, function of your Vibratome Series 1000 Microtome. You go ahead and turn it on, turn the lamp on, uh, set your amplitude and your speed. Uh, today we're going to be using just a wood block with some wax on it. It's not the ideal medium for uh, cutting, but it's going to work fine for display purposes. We don't want to, you know, cut a chunk of person for this. <laughs> so the way that we adjust the uh, the specimen thickness is uh, with the dial here. It's relative, so if you've cut at zero, if you go to ten, it's going to do ten. Uh, twenty is twenty, but if you start at twenty, then thirty will do ten, and forty would do twenty. So it's relative to wherever you did your last cut. So for our cut, I'm going to go ahead and do it at a thickness of one hundred just because it's wax and it doesn't it's, it's, it's difficult to cut wax on this machine but uh, it does a pretty good job with it so we go ahead and start it, we have a speed keep the speed low amplitude, I like to keep, it works on a, a higher amplitude with the wax uh, you know, it's, you're going to have different settings for different specimens and here we go so you can hear the amplitude adjusts I won't mess with the speed right now because we're in the middle of a cut. But, uh, as you can see, it's cutting a nice little roll there. It's typically when I'd offer some filler commentary. There was a nice little 100 micron. You can see it catching a little bit. That's because it's wax and it's not, it doesn't go exactly flat uh, with this type of cutting. Um, so, since we did it at 100, I'll go ahead and rotate it again. One full go around for another 100 micron cut. Start it up. another cut just like the last one so you can see that it's cutting consistently uh, it is indeed lifting the specimen uh, the correct amount and it is vibrating just the way it's supposed to We'll do one more cut uh, and we'll do it at a faster speed just so you can see. So I'm rotating it 100, you know, all the way around for another 100 uh, micron cut. I'm going to crank the speed up a bit so you can tell the difference between, you can see that it's actually adjusting the speed. So as you can see it's going much faster now, it might, uh, yeah, it looks like it's cutting pretty good anyway. It's not as precise, it'll probably catch more on the way back, but yeah, let's see, there you go. There you go, everything works.